I'm Bob Hesselbein. I'm honored to be president of the Vietnam Helicopter Pilots Association. We are coming to Arlington National Cemetery today to honor the almost 500 Vietnam helicopter pilots and crew members who are buried here within Arlington National Cemetery. And they represent the over 5,000 helicopter pilots and crew members who died in combat operations in the Vietnam War. The helicopters joining us in this memorial service today bring back the spirit of those who rest here. The Huey helicopter was a workhorse of the Vietnam War. It would deliver the soldiers to battle. It was a gunship used to protect the soldiers on the ground. It would resupply. It would do medical evacuation. I was a young 19-year-old gunship pilot in Vietnam, and the heroes that I saw were there, the incredible people who did such brave things, they sacrificed themselves for their nation. A young pilot named Carlos Pedrosa was our last casualty. Carlos was killed on the airfield at Con Tum, north of Pleiku, by an enemy rocket. If you look at Carlos's stone, his love for aviation, what he did is apparent. One of the interesting things of our heroes buried in Arlington National Cemetery is some came immediately upon their death, but many came 20, 30 years later. They laid in the soil of Vietnam and they were painstakingly recovered and their remains came here as a crew. Today we are dedicating a living tree in their memory and we're here to honor the memory of the many young men who were helicopter pilots and crew members who lost their lives in combat during the Vietnam War. And of course, to honor all Vietnam veterans and all Vietnam casualties who lie here in Arlington National Cemetery today.